local man is working to educate the public about a historic trail. Yes, so Cody's caravan is in Auburn getting some fresh air and learning all about the Western States Trail. Hey, Cody. We are indeed, we are indeed. So Saturday, I'm sitting on my couch, got my feet up, having a cold beverage. What were you doing, Hal? What were you doing? Well, let's see, we were up on the high, in the high Sierras, a uh, place called Barker Pass, you can okay. drive to it. Um, we were scouting a route that we think the six member party from uh, the 1844 group of uh, immigrants who were coming west, the Stevens Murphy Townsend party. Oh, okay. And uh, they were the first to cross the Sierras. But they got to what we now know as Truckee. Well, we got some dignitaries oh, going by. Yeah, it's the former mayor of Auburn coming on by. Good to see you guys. Good to see you. Good you know to see what? you. Hal's lost right now. <laughs> <laughs> Who are those guys? <laughs> I told you, everybody knows Hal. Everybody knows Hal. So you're up there. Yeah. And, uh, so we're following the route that we think that the, the you know the party split uh the most of the wagon uh, party of 50 traveled west uh, from that point okay. but it, it, it had snowed this is two years prior to the donna reed party uh they went they good news they made it over the pass okay but they weren't sure when they took a look at that sierra crossing and just to make sure the leader of the party um, said let's get a group of six or so and head a different direction, get them to uh, Sutter's Fort and help bring help back. Oh, okay. That was the idea. And then there was three uh, fellows that remained at the camp um, right there at the uh, Donner Memorial State Park. So not only historian, but a little bit of a private detective, a detective, if you will, to yeah. have to find these stories and figure out where they were. Well, and it's a question mark because it's, um, um, where did they go? They didn't have a journal or a diary to, you know, uh, the landmarks weren't named yet. Yeah. Uh, the rivers didn't have names. Uh, the mountains didn't have names. So where did they go? And we have just very few clues to tell us. And we've narrowed it down to a couple passes in the Sierras. Uh, and yesterday was the, or excuse me, not yesterday, but Saturday was our first scouting trip. And when you look at the landscape, you wonder, you put them yourself in their place at that point in time. And you pass, got over the pass. Where would be the the path of least resistance? Oh, okay. Yeah. Because that's where they're. By the time they got to this point, having traveled all the way across the country on on foot, horseback, or by wagon, where would they have, by their means, go? And so that's what we did this Saturday. That is so fun. I, I, I'm lost, so I wish I'd been in the mountains with you. Oh, yeah. I would, yeah. <laughs> We're going to take some more hiking uh, in, on the trail with Hal. Once again, Sean, my man, walking forward and backward on the trail. You, you're my guy. You're my guy. Uh, Hal, uh, if people want to know more about the museum that you guys are setting up, and we'll talk a little bit about that later, later on, what do they need to do? Well, they, they could uh, go to their search engine mm -hmm. and type in Western States Trail Museum. It'll pop up. Uh, and the website is cool. It has vintage photographs, Native American settlers, all the people we've been talking about. And then, of course, uh, if you want to read more about the history of the Western States Trail, I do. Go to uh, historyexp.org. Okay. It's or Google search uh, history expeditions. We have uh, a free ebooks to read about the history of the trail. Um, video uh, so our Saturday venture hasn't been posted yet <laughs> but it's it's, it's yeah it's available fantastic all right more hiking with Al coming up back to you guys this is Thanks fun